How's everybody doing? God bless. Um, this video is probably the most compelling and best video I'm ever going to make. This is Bullseye, Amos 8, Bullseye. I'll go over the Bible verses. Yes, a lot of times I'll have videos and I will show some videos at the end. But here we are at the 4th. I'm looking at the 9th of Av, which is the 27th. It starts on the 27th. It's also the Lion's Gate. I will go over it. Jesus is the Lion of the tribe of Judah. This is Amos 8. It talks about Jacob. So, yes, I am watching. Why am I making this video? I can see everything come into place, as we all can know, is fed one, or fed now, as they call it, with the money. I believe that a few things should happen. I will have this video out at midnight tonight. <clears throat> it said, everything says destruction by um, terror by night, destruction by noonday. I'm watching the ninth of Av, as I said. We'll see what happens in the coming days. We could be out of here by Friday, but this is the most compelling video that I'll ever make, I believe. Now let's get to the Bible. Amos 8. Amos 8 talks about turning your morning right here in 7. It also says Egypt right here. Egypt right here. Egypt. The floods. Just like when Moses left. It says, I the Lord sworn by the excellency of Jacob who I will never forget any of their works. And it says the floods of Egypt. And we're here. So it's talking about Jacob in, in Egypt. This is the lion's gate. Most people know Jesus, Jacob, right here. Judah is the lion. Jesus is from the tribe of Judah. And this is about Jacob. It says right at the top of it. Jacob and his sons. It called into his sons. This is Joseph, the lineage through Egypt. Which Joseph, everybody knows about Joseph in Egypt. Same thing. Talks about the heaven and the sea. Joseph, there you go, Egypt, Joseph's wife, if you don't know, Joseph's wife was an Egyptian, right here it says it again, Judah, as a lion from the prey, my sons have gone up and he stood, So in Amos 8, when it talks about Jacob and his sons, it also talks about lions. It also talks about Egypt. It says right here, Shall not the land trouble for this, and every one mourn and dwell therein? It shall raise up like a flood, and shall be cast down as the floods of Egypt. This is talking about Egypt. This is talking about the pyramids also. The pyramids, Egypt, the flood. Amos 8. Seeketh him that made the seven stars in Orion and turned the shadow of death into morning and making it dark with night and shall the waters of the sea be pour them out upon the face of the earth. The Lord is thy name. In Amos 8, it talks about rebuked at the gate. This is the lion's gate. Seek good, not evil. 
and live. The Lord, a God of hosts, shall be with you. Talks about judgment at the gate. This is the lion's gate, and I will show it right now. It's also the ninth of Av. The ninth of Av is the 27th, okay? 27th, 28th. As I showed you, Jesus is the Lion of the tribe of Judah. And I will show you where this is in I Pet Goat. Lion's Gate. Now let's go to this right here. I saw this and I, I was like, bingo. As I have shown in my videos, Helafont made two videos. This one right here and... This one right here with the pyramids at the ending scene. This is an alignment. This is the lion's gate. Right here, 88. Bingo. Here it is right here. The pyramid and the warehouse, the SOS warehouse. SOS labyrinth aligned to 88.88 degrees. This is the lion's gate. This is an Ipet goat. It's about Egypt in the pyramids. As I showed you, jo jo Jacob and Joseph and Genesis and Amos. Here it is right here. The pyramid and the warehouse, the SOS warehouse. SOS labyrinth aligned to 88.88 degrees. Coincidence? Coincidence? No, they did it on purpose. They know. I'm glad he did this because this is awesome. This is also in Egypt. And the warehouse, the SOS warehouse, SOS labyrinth, aligned to 88.88 degrees. There you go. This is exactly like Egypt. Also shows an iPad goat, the ending scene. Also, too, as it says, it talks about the flood, as I showed earlier, in Amos and Genesis, as a flood of Egypt. Well, there is a comet coming, as I showed in my other videos. What does it say? On July 1st. By the time July's new moon arrives on July 7th. New moon be gone. New moon be gone. New moon be gone, the 17th. New moon be gone. Does that sound familiar? Yes, that is in Amos, as I told you. As the new moon be gone. Amos 5, is it? No, I think it's Amos 8. Right here. Saying, when will the new moon be gone, and we shall buy corn, and the Sabbath may set forth the wheat and make the Ephraim small, if if Epha fall small, gather wheat, satisfying the balances of deceit. This lines up perfectly. Seventeenth, the comp will be approaching its maximum brightness and will have moved eastward toward the constellation Cetus, the whale. Cetus, the whale. As the flood. As, um, Jonah, the whale. So this comet's coming about the same time. Now let's get to the pyramids. The pyramids lines up with the Milky Way in Orion's belt. Here it is, a picture of it right here. There's the lion in Sirius. This lines up with everything. Leo the lion. This lines up with Orion's belt and the pyramids right here. He that maketh the seven stars in Orion. A 
as you can see, there's seven stars in Orion. He that maketh seven stars in Orion. There is Sirius. It lines up right with the pictures. This is also in Ghostbusters with the stairs. The pyramid has the stairs in it. This is also in Men in Black. There's an alien come to Earth and he is warning about it. We know in the Bible there's a war in heaven. That's that's what the Bible says. There's a war in heaven. And he says where it's at. Warren's Orion's belt. This is Men in Black. That's exactly what it is right here. Orion's belt. Right here. Orion's belt. It's also on Aaron Rodgers' tattoo. As you can see there, there's a pyramid. There's a pyramid right here. Aligning, there's all C and I. That's Orion's belt right there. The pyramid was a lion. Khufu. That Obama looks like. Khufu. Right here. The great sphinx right here in the desert. The face of a lion is... Claimed it was if you notice it's it's out of proportion The Egyptians disfigured it But it was a lion at one time It's also in back to the future When this baby hits 88 miles per hour You're gonna see some serious shit So, this is also Back to the Future. As I said, Jesus is from the tribe of Judah. He's the Lion of the tribe of Judah. I'm looking at the Ninth of Av, as I said. The Ninth of Av is right here. The Lion Gate portal officially opens on July 28th. This was last year's article, but it's the same. It opens at the same time every year. When an opportunity brings, it's it's the year when it closes on 8889. That's 88. So this is the time frame I'm looking at right here. It starts uh the alignment with the pyramids uh starts on the July July right at this time frame. The 7th and 8th. Actually, this year it's the 27th. Every year it's about this time. And it, and it closes the, the official. And it's called the Lion's Gate. So, this is referenced, as I said. This is referenced in Genesis uh, 49 with Jacob, the sons of the tribe of Judah. Right here, the Levites. This is also... Uh, also talks about here the tribe of Dan, which it's a serpent. Talks about Jacob made it right here. Also talks about the tribe of Dan.
It says right here, Dan shall judge his people as one of the tribes of Israel. Dan shall be a serpent by the way and adder in the path and bite the heels of the rider as shall fall back. So it's almost like the tribe of Dan's going to be the ones causing the judgment or also talks. These are about the tribes. So Jesus is the tribe of Judah, the lion of the tribe of Judah, the lion's gate, which opens on Tishbeav, the ninth of Av. And that's what I'm looking at. This is when it opens and this is when the temples were destroyed. This is also in Amos, as I showed right here. Amos seeketh him that sets the seven stars in Orion. Shadow of night into morning. Woe unto the desires the day of the Lord, the end of his for you. The day of the Lord is darkness and not light. This is also in Amos 8, as I showed. It says, Jacob, which is 7, the Lord has sworn, sworn to the excellency of Jacob, the lion. Also talks about Egypt, as I have shown. God bless you all. This is what I'm looking at. Yes, I am watching the events that I will be putting out every day or every when they happen. I'm watching at Damascus. I'm watching Israel. Things arise. I'm watching the money situation. I'm watching. I'm praying every day as you are. We'll see what happens. This is what I'm watching. And if anything comes up, yes, we could leave any day. But this is what I'm watching. And as I said, when I saw this in, I, I was, there's things, more things. That, I was going to make videos on this if we were still here. But when I saw this, I'm like, wow. Wow. West Labyrinth. Aligned to 88.88 degrees. This is also, as I showed, this is Men in Black. This is also... It's also in the Truman Show because he does say serious, serious. Um, this is also an IPEC Gold, the ending scene. As I said, there's two videos made. They both are, had the pyramids in it right here, just as this one. As it talks about in Genesis and Amos, it talks about Egypt. So God bless. This is what I'm watching. God bless.